everybody, it's Crazy Fango Slime here because I'm having an amazing day. So we are going to be continuing with episode 9 of Vox Machina, uh, A Test of Pride. Um, I I mean, I can't even believe already that we're on episode 9. It just feels like the show's flying through. But anyway, we had such a great episode previously. We were in the Fey Realm, we got to meet ugh, Vex and Vax's father, um, the... Mm -hmm. My high and mighty, uh, <laughs> and then we got Percy and Vex, the cute moments, yay! And then um, we got to see Vex like fight against that arch fay, um, and then got um, Venthris, and then also we saw Grog still struggling to get his strength back, but. Overall, an incredible episode. Absolutely loved it. Um, and just so many Easter eggs as well that just made me super happy. But we're going to continue with this next episode. Episode 9, of course, A Test of Pride. Um, and I feel like we are obviously going to be focused more on Grog and his story. Um, and this part is like my favourite. So we're just going to jump straight into it. Before that, please remember to like, subscribe and comment if you enjoyed this video. But also keep up to date with all my other reactions to more TV shows, movies and video games. So without further ado, let's jump straight into it. Oh, oh! 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 Oh my god. God. And work, boy. You do the herd proud. Take what he wants and teach him to fear the name. Grog Songjaw. Wait, that's Grog? Oh shit. Damn! Oh my god! <laughs> Super beefy dude wore these stone gauntlets that were like glowing. The vestiges. Well, looks like those guys moved on. We should get back to Will then, you know, before he starts wondering where we are. Hey, these people could use our help. We gave all I had. There's nothing left. Then <sighs> get out of my sight. Hold the past oh, with no. That's one thing I don't like about war or anything like that. Where they like play like that. Ugh. Uh, who's Kev Oh, Kev Dad. Their leader, my uncle. When you want to be, maybe you should take lead on this one. Would you be impressed if I single handedly infiltrated Western and would be the bravest thing I've ever seen? Then it shall be done. If Scott. Okay. Nevosh <laughs> Nevon <laughs> When I was with the herd, I did things. Real bad mm. things. For the day I met him. Little hand. Spare me! Oh. I, I have a family! Oh. For up. I didn't sign up to take orders from a bloody dragon. What say you, Zanroar? I say, someone needs to stand up to my father. And take this herd back. <laughs> Who the phone? Just unlucky. Farmers, shopkeepers. When the dragon attacks. Is that who I think it is? Some would say philosopher named Scanlan. As in Scanlan Shorthalt? I could have killed him. I think that's who I think it is. I love that they've done the story, how they did it. Strong jaw! Oh no. He went and complained to dad. Oh! 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 I don't think they can take them killing one of their own. Oh my god. You are hereby banished from the herd of storms. Grog! Oh my god. Try to heal him. Oh. <gasps> Pike! Baby Pike. God, he's back already? Stay, but we'll find the gold for your precious conclave, even if it means expanding our efforts. 
see that you do. I am displeased. <laughs> oh. I return in three days' time, Kildak. If you do not bring me Thordak's gold, I think your arms as payment. Don't worry. How long must we endure this, father? We reduce the servants. Hold your tongue, dragons. Teaching them to fear us. Instead, your weakness has us groveling like... <gasps> I tire of your whining. Um. <laughs> oh my god. You better go in with a mighty fine offering. <laughs> oh god. Nice plan, Mikey. Hey, what's with calling me a turd? Oh, sorry. <laughs> that was like, you know, acting. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> oh. Grog. Good. Then now's our chance. Follow Grog, okay? Once he gets you through the gates, make for the tree line. Come on. Go. Oh. They're afraid of Grog. I'm not going. What do you mean? Unless I take down Kevdak. Grog. Kevdak, gotta stick together. Not this time. I have to do this on my own. No, hidden heart and being big don't make you strong. It's standing up for the little folk. That's what makes me different from them. But... He's found his strength. I say to you, all are free to go. <laughs> but questioning my leadership is something I cannot abide. <laughs> Remember me. No. No, you leave it there. Oh my god. Oh, why? <laughs> that was so good. And it was just starting to get so juicy. Yeah, such a good episode. And I like that we did meet some new characters. But first, let's go into the whole thing with Grog. I loved like learning more about his backstory or that like people would learn about his backstory his backstory is like heartbreaking in a way just because you know he comes from that lifestyle i guess of like violence and just you know i guess pillaging like villages for treasure and for wealth and even just for violence as fun um and just yeah the fact that will hand really changed that was just so heartbreaking Breaking. And then also because of the fact that Pike healed him and he didn't die. Like, oh, this is oh, so heartbreaking. And then seeing him actually, like, you know, go into the city with Pike and then obviously rescue those people. And then the fear they had for him. He realized, like, in that moment, no, he has to stay back. And in a way, I feel like this is the beginning of him finding his strength. Like, fighting for the little folk. Like, oh, my heart. And just, yeah, that last cry of him just being like... Oh, he's screaming. Just so good. Loved it. Ah! But yeah, these three episodes were great. I think they were great, um, again, like, sort of, like, interjection from, I guess, all of, like, the drama we've had with, in terms of, like, Tal'Dorei. Um, they're back in Tal'Dorei, which is good, so we're gonna slowly, I guess, come to the finishing line with the, um, Chroma Conclave. Not yet. There's plenty more story to go ahead with this, with it. But we're slowly coming to that part where we're, the team is slowly coming back together. And yeah, we're slowly seeing, like, all of them finding, I guess, their strengths. Um, finding, I guess, understanding their, like, weaknesses in a way, but more understanding their strengths and how they can be better people, fighters, and warriors. But anyway, ugh, gonna leave it there. Thank you guys so much for watching this. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please give a like, subscribe, comment, and tell me your thoughts on the last three episodes that we've had for The Legend of Vox Machina. So, so good. But again, thank you guys so much for watching this, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Crazy Finger out. Woo!